FYI, I know you think that people are listening to your reasons and your stories about how you're somehow not good enough for all the joy and magnificence of life that other people seem to have. The truth is, we tuned out a long time ago. Um, you may be talking about your limitations, but we're not even listening anymore. We're all thinking about the fact that we have to stop for groceries on the way home and whether or not we need more cat food. <laughs> so what I'm really inviting you to do, oh my beloved, spiritual family is to come into the realization of your sacredness and your power. I'm inviting you to step into the infinite freedom of expression and creative abundance, to begin to dance with that doubt instead of pushing it out here, but to bring it into your life and to front and center love it into a greater understanding, to begin to interrogate, what is this about? Why am I doubting? Where did I get that? Is that the truth of who I am? Is that the truth of the life I want? So how do we begin to step into that freedom? Uh, step one, we stop telling the stories. Step two, you start telling a new story. Now, if you're not presently where you want to be, what you tell the story about is exploration, curiosity, possibility, dreams, 